You may have heard stories that a frozen bottle of champagne explodes due to changes in the density of the beverage. Let's try to investigate what happens in reality. If freezing a bottle of champagne is worth doing at all, it is believed that prior to tasting, champagne should be cooled to a temperature of seven to nine degrees Celsius. For cooling, it's not necessary to use the freezer, but in order to speed up the process, many people prefer this method. If you left a bottle of champagne in the freezer and forgot about it, no need to worry. Apart from the conversion of the liquid into ice, nothing will happen. However, during defrosting, there are a certain number of rules that must be followed. To prevent the bottle from breaking due to sharp temperature change, in this case, you should put it in under hot water. The correct way is moving it from the freezer to the refrigerator compartment for one to two hours, and then to a dark, cool place. At the stage when almost no ice is left, move the bottle into a dark place already at room temperature. And after 30 to 40 minutes, the drink will be ready for use. Note that it is strictly prohibited to open a bottle with ice inside because of the high probability of getting a cold burn or injuring oneself with glass. Do not try to quickly unfreeze the drink with hot water as the sharp temperature difference will dramatically increase the amount of carbon dioxide, which leads to an explosion. Boom! If guests are on the doorstep and the champagne stays frozen in the freezer, just be smarter to go to the store for a new bottle without exposing yourself to a possible injury.